Around this time every year, 58 journalists from 22 different countries are faced with the task of choosing the best new car, which is then to be awarded the title of European Car of the Year. Not always an easy decision, as the latest new models on show are often so close in the running that less than a handful of points can decide who wins and who comes close. This year, the new VW Passat GTE was the apple of the jury's eye. The plug-in hybrid edged ahead of the pack to win the much-acclaimed prize. The title European Car of the Year has been awarded annually since 1964, and VW have now won it for the fourth time. Former VW winners were the Golf in 1992, the Polo in 2010, and then the Golf again in 2013. So it's no surprise that VW are proud this year to see the Passat GTE get ahead of the competition. We're really honored because this Car of the Year award, which we've received, is an award which has tradition and a very long history. And the Passat is currently the ultimate example of modular transverse matrix design. It has the very latest technology, normally only found in top-of-the-range limousines. Driver assistance systems, emergency assistance systems, that means it's packed with safety features. It really is a joy to drive, and we have a very wide range of drive technology. For example, here you see the Passat GTE, which has a range of 50 kilometers powered electrically, meaning zero emission. It has a total range of over 1,000 kilometers and gives you everything you need when you're driving. The contenders are always the new models, which were first launched in the last 12 months. In Europe's most prestigious car award, the most important criteria are technical innovation and value for money.